Sounds a little sketchy. Look, Master, a treasure chest. We shall have to find a way to reach it. Fancy a gander? I find goods for sale. I always have a warm welcome for a customer. Much obliged. Well, now, really now. Where can you do, please, eh? I'll take on whatever work you've got. Have you forgotten something, Arisen? You're looking rather lost. What did he say his name was again? Ah, Humphrey. The lad's in Vermouth now. He's eager. I'll give him that. Expedition, sword drills, say the word and he'll join in at a moment's notice. Say, you look experienced. You should talk to the lad. I'm sure he'll be glad of a bit of guidance. I'm unsure how best this is I would fain aid you if you are in need. Going out, are you? You sure that's a good idea? You seem rather unwell. You ought at least rest for the evening. There should be a spare bed in the lodgings yonder. Only don't go rushing off before you're ready. Take it from me. You're better off resting while you have the chance. Sir, how can I be of assistance? Hoi there. You seem well tired. Tell you what, you can stay here tonight free of charge. I'll expect coin from tomorrow, mind. My pa always used to say, there's naught a good night's sleep can't fix. Not much else I can offer, I'm afraid, but you'll find all sorts at a finer inn. Aye, being armed is better than being defenceless, even if you're untrained. Still, tis worth devoting yourself to a vocation if you can. Opens up new doors, it does. You should stop by the inn in Melv if you get the chance. No hard feelings if you prefer it. They've much more to offer. Aye, being armed is better than being defenceless, even if you're untrained. Still, it is worth devoting yourself to a vocation if you can. Opens up new doors, it does. You should stop by the inn in Melv if you get the chance. No hard feelings if you prefer it. They've much more to offer. I have no issue falling asleep, even at this time of day.
We're running low on everything. From provisions to crafting materials for weapons and armor. We've had a hard time procuring goods, what with all the monsters lurking on the roads of late. I sent Marcus to gather what we need, but I've just taken stock and I fear the list I gave him was incomplete. What say you? Could I trouble you to run an errand for me? <laughs> You'll be paid, of course. Glad to hear it. Here, take this list of additional supplies to Marcus. He ought to be somewhere north of here. Hand him the note and he'll take care of the rest. Heyo! You a soldier? Could be a surprise to see you arrive in one piece if not. Hordes of monsters have been plaguing this area of late, you see. We've had to start sending out new recruits to cull them. Is that so? Who went yonder? Lachlan. But I dare say he'll fare all right. Aye, I expect he will. Who was sent out that way, then? Accardo. To be honest, sir, I'm a little worried for him. What? Weren't harpies reported in that area? The lad can't handle those beasts on his own. This is the first I'm hearing of it. Fie! I want to go to his aid, but we can't just abandon our posts. Say, you seem stout of heart. Would you be willing to go in our stead? Tisn't far. Only a short ways out from the main gate. You've my thanks. And Accardo's as well, I'm sure. We must make haste if we are to arrive in time to assist. Master Goblins! <laughs> Naught compares to the thrill of victory. One cannot help but feel indomitable. Who are you? 
you. That was thrilling. I did not know I could feel so alive. I'll carefully conserve my strength and endeavor to survive every battle by way of sound strategy and defensive tactics. Is that all of them? Yeah, you have my thanks. I do not believe for a moment I could have slain those creatures without your help. I've only just enlisted, and when I thought this could be the end of me, I, I was paralyzed. You saved me this time, but I won't always be so fortunate. I'll have to train harder till I have the confidence to face such beasts on my own. Well, I'd best be heading back but I'll be sure to let my superiors know of your good deed. I hope we meet again someday. Don't we have a report to make, Master? Hey, old friend. Many thanks for aiding Ocado. Twas a relief to see him return, and none the worse for wear. Aye, that it was. The poor sod might not have made it back alive had you not intervened. Twas a bit too early for him to be seeing actual combat. That much was made well clear. We'll be extending his training period. The instructors here are well known for whipping recruits into shape with their grueling regimes. <laughs> Speaking of training regimes, I must admit I've half a mind to ask you to join us. We could use someone with your experience. Tis a goodly deed we've done. Now, Sir Ricardo can return to his duty in good health. I can hardly believe it. A griffin of all things here. Add to that the recent dragon sighting. It is said that the arrival of the Sovereign portends an age of peace, yet only trouble has followed. What does it all mean? I had thought being in the Border Watch would make for easy work, but the wind's beginning to blow in a fell direction.
Like you don't know, I must go when duty calls me. Little... How could I have forestalled this? That's everything assembled. A job well done if I do say so myself. Oi, did you need something? This is from Sir Geoffrey, is it? Let's have a look then. He wants these as well, does he? I thought I was finished. Why should I have to do all this on my own? I've got plenty to carry as tis. Say, your arms look free. You can handle that list in my stead. And make haste. I would depart for the encampment even a moment sooner. Well, go on. You know what to do. We know what we're looking for, but not where it is. I suppose there's naught for it but to start searching.
Not a foe in sight. look forward to but a long day of work how goes it have you gathered everything on the list yet haven't you anything for me yet well, you best get to it then.
Soon as my shift's done, I'm off to the tavern. I mustn't let the captain see my Fancy a gander? I fancy a gander? I find goods for sale. Always a pleasure. Shall we report back now? How goes it? Have you gathered everything on the list yet? Brilliant! I knew I could count on you. Here, take this for your trouble. I'll be heading back to the encampment now. They'll be expecting me. Oi, many thanks for passing on that list to Marcus for me. As I hear it, you even assisted him in gathering the supplies. <laughs> I hope it wasn't too much trouble. Anyway, you've been a great help. I hope I can count on your aid again should the need arise. Our efforts have seen the encampment resupplied and Sir Geoffrey with one less care. A good deed all round. Many thanks for helping us replenish our stores. I hope I can count on your aid again, should the need arise. First the dragon, now a griffin. I pray these omens are not as ill as they seem. I hasten home, but it's not my duty. Best quality a soldier can have in this world. Hail. Have a gander at my wares. You shan't regret it. Need anything? Mayhap I can help, sir. Pleasure doing business with you. I've beds to spare if you're looking for lodgings, and if you'd like to change your vocation, come see me any time. Business could be better, but I'm scraping by.
Do come again. No sense letting the enemy gain the upper hand. The early griffin is the worm, as they say. <laughs> Over so soon? Why, we seem to have come through unscathed. That was impeccably timed, Arisen. Goblins approach! <laughs> Help! Oh. 